The club member's handicap is next. It's a 10 furlong 0 to 85. Call of the Storm, Martin Lewis, a top weight. Townhouse, David Robertson. Blood Orange, Daniel French. Early warning, Paul Parsons. Replica, Padre Hogan. Well timed, Paul Parsons. Lucky Moon, Nick Driver. Fox on the run and friendly May for Alex Cherry. And half a rack for Matt Cooper. A field of 10 for this one. I think it's the final race before the British Cup starts. They're away and racing. A little bit slow out was Townhouse. The grey closest to us is Friendly May. Or is it? No, it isn't. Friendly May is the one over on the far side. The grey closest to us is Fox on the run. And Alex Cherry's got two in a blue cap in this one. Half a rack in second. And then well timed is third. Lucky Moon is after that one. And then towards the back replica it's just their back marker and friendly mate clearing the lead for Alex Cherry with Lucky Moon second and early warning third and half a rack in the red jacket is fourth almost five in a line then well, they're probably just headed by well timed and towards the back replica is about two or three lengths of drift of the rest of them oh Padre Hogan but he's had a couple today come flying at the end I'm sure he wouldn't mind if he gets a third one to do that. Friendly May is the leader though for Alex Cherry with just a little more than five furlongs to go. Half a rack is in second. Lucky Moon is in third. Then Call of the Storm, the top weight. Blood Orange is next. Then comes Well Timed Early Warning. Fox on the run on the inside of town, on the outside of Townhouse with Replica, just the back marker. But Friendly May continuing to lead then as they make their way towards the straight with now well time coming through the challenge in second half a rack is next call of the storm carrying a big weight moves into second then comes blood orange early warning replica is starting to make a move around the outside but it's friendly may who's in the lead friendly may from call of the storm and half a rack here comes replica who's now moving through could he make it a nice padre hogan treble and it's now friendly may in the lead being pressed by replica call of the storm on the inside blood orange and then well time shortly between these as they come down towards the final furlong Replica's hit the front, but has he gone too soon this time? It's Replica in the lead. Blood Orange in second. Call of the Storm is back in third, but Replica is pulling away, and it's going to be a treble for Padre Hogan. And Replica takes it well clear. And Replica wins it well. Time does run on to be second. Then Townhouse early morning, Lucky Moon, and all the way back to half a rack. So, Padre Hogan gets himself a treble on day one. Join me with a treble on day one as well. We don't say that very often. On day one of the flat racing, three winners for Padre Hogan and three winners for me. You can tell it's a back to front upside down week this week. A replica takes it for Padre Hogan. Well timed second for Paul Parsons. Townhouse David Robertson was third. Early warning Paul Parsons again fourth. And Blood Orange for Daniel French was back in fifth. <laughs>